What's up guys, it's your boy Mr. P96 In this video, I'm going to be talking about Call of Duty and when it's going to end So basically, for me, I've played Call of Duty ever since Well, I've, I've played Call of Duty 4, but when I really started was in 2008 When Call of Duty 5 was out That was my favourite Call of Duty, and it still is today It's one of my favourite games to be honest, because um, it is different to the other games But um, it's really fun to play at the same time So anyway I bought Call of Duty 5 um, for PS3. When um, I bought P I bought Call of Duty 4 as well at the same time actually, but I played Call of Duty 5 first. But um, anyway, Call of Duty 4 was brilliant because like it was the first proper Call of Duty multiplayer game that um, on consoles, and it like stuck out. So that was pretty good, and it changed the way we saw first-person shooters. Well, for many people anyway, because um, some of us. I haven't played like first person shooters properly before that, but Call of Duty Online and all that is, um, you know, it's pretty big, pretty big business as well. And the quick scoping on Call of Duty 4 was just immense. It was like the best thing ever. But um, yeah, and they took took away that um, ability in Black Ops, which was a bit of a fail. But anyway, Call of Duty 5. This Call of Duty was the best in my opinion. Not only because it's my first Call of Duty game I ever played. But like it was the first time I actually properly had fun playing Call of Duty. I mean Call of Duty 4 was brilliant in that, but Call of Duty 5 was just different. And like I used to do so well in that game. I still do now to be honest, but um, you know it's been hacked and all that kind of stuff, so and um the servers they're gonna probably end the servers as well, like take them down because no one really plays it anymore. Other noobs only play it, but there's no point playing against them because you, I know I always keep you always win it. Always win over time and it gets a bit annoying because um they never ever get kills and it's a bit shit like so yeah um, everything about the game is just amazing the maps are brilliant the guns are great and the weapons are fairly balanced as well to be honest but um, there are a few weapons that are a bit overpowered let's say the mp40 dual magazines that weapon was really overpowered but um, at the same time that weapon was um, pretty beast to get kills with and um, I love the kill streak set up on that as well because it was a basic 357, which was recon plane, artillery, and dogs. Um, I used to get dogs like all the time. Now I, I, I can still get dogs now, but it's not um not as like the same feeling because back in the day when I used to play it, I used to get dogs like three times every match, and um, I used to always come top. And I still do now actually, but like um you know back then it was just a different game because everyone used to play it as well. But anyway, the only thing that ruined Call of Duty 5 for me was um, when it got hacked. That was pretty disappointing because um, you know you couldn't play the game properly, and that was a bit irritating. But anyway, on to Modern Warfare 2, which is Call of Duty 6. Um, this game was I liked this game at first, but after a bit, I got a bit irritated by the noob tubes. I think most people did. But um, the quick scoping in this game was sick. It's like amazing, and. Um, I love the way you could like um, customize like everything. You could have um, it was like there's so many more attachments than um, Call of Duty 4 or COD 5. You could have um, the let's say what was it, ACOG scope and all that kind of stuff, thermal scope, and yeah, that was just pretty good. And but the, the only thing about this game was the kill streaks so are overpowered. Anyway, Black Ops. This was a great game, but the hit hit detection was really bad, and it had a really bad connection on PS3 to be honest. Because um, P Xbox have de dedicated servers and so do PC, so it's not too bad on them game on them games like them consoles. But um, for PS3, it was a bit like it hit host migration, which is pretty annoying. And then like sometimes it just froze on the screen. But anyway, Black Ops was an alright game, yeah. But um, yeah, oh yeah, um, zombies are brilliant. Zombies was um the main thing about Black Ops that I really liked. But um. And, and dogs as well because they brought dogs back didn't they, Treyarch which is a pretty beast and Black Ops 2 looks pretty promising so yeah I'll get that game when it comes out and obviously the game that we play, all play now is um, Modern Warfare 3 which was um, it's still actually been, uh, it's pretty popular now to be honest but um, when Black Ops comes out it's gonna die out I guarantee, I can almost guarantee it, that game is not the best but yeah anyway um Modern Warfare 3 is a good game but it's a bit boring 
because after a bit the colors are a bit dull and um it's the same same thing really because um call of duty is going to die out slowly i've got a feeling because um right now all these gamers are like quitting but um yeah so i reckon call of duty is going to die out um about two or three games the next two or three games they make is probably going to die out unless they can rejuvenate it and make it better but um that's been pretty hard because um, Call of Duty 4 like, set the benchmark really really high um, War that War did as well for me um, Black Ops was alright Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 was alright as well but Modern Warfare 3 was alright as well to be honest but anyway what do you think about this guys and I need some commentary, commentary topics for my next video right then guys um, thanks for watching rate, comment, subscribe share the video to Facebook and Twitter right then guys thanks for watching